Hi, I'm Redskins historian Mike Richman, author of the Washington Redskins Football Vault and the Redskins Encyclopedia. If you're like me, you're a diehard Redskins fan. And believe me, across the D.C. area, there are millions of staunch supporters of the Redskins, one of the most storied franchises in NFL history. My passion for the Redskins has led me to produce and host a TV show called Burgundy and Gold Magazine, which provides a close-up and analytical look at the past, present, and future of the Washington Redskins. In doing the show, I've had the opportunity to interview many Redskins legends, as well as a host of current players. My goal is to educate and entertain those across the vast landscape of Redskins Nation, and to bring the Redskins community closer together. B&G Magazine airs regularly in Montgomery, Prince George's, and Fairfax counties, with a potential TV viewership of about a million people in each county. All of my shows are also streamed on the web. Now, let me show you some of the more eye-catching clips from B&G Magazine. What has your relationship been like with Sonny Jorgensen? Like a brother. He said to me, which nobody's ever said before, you're the brother I never had. That's how close we are. This is the 2010 debut of Burgundy and Gold Magazine. Thank you very much for joining us. With me, Redskins great Brian Mitchell, destined for the Pro Football Hall of Fame, even though he's probably not going to admit it right now. It's bound to happen. He's been paid $32 million for four sacks already. That's $8 million sack. I can live on that. What do you but think of this guy? If Alfred Ainsworth comes in here out of shape this year, the Redskins is trying to find a way to try to get the NFLPA to agree with them and get some of their money back. I heard, you, I heard what you said, Chris. I find it difficult that if I'm a defensive coordinator, you working for me, and you not sort of putting out that I like you. Because a football coach is a football coach. Uh, it's like if you don't do what I say do, hit the road. Right. You want to find players that are hungry, yeah, yeah. that want, that yeah. are out there, that want to win. Yeah, yeah. You don't need to be paying guys $100 million. Yeah. All right, we need to go to break. Uh, please stick with us. This is Burgundy and Gold Magazine. <laughs> Former Maryland center Edwin Williams is proud to be a Redskin. Oh yeah, undoubtedly the Redskins, man. I love them, man. Uh, I literally live five minutes away from RFK and about another 10 from here. So I've uh -huh. um, always kind of been into the Redskins culture. You know, always wanted to be a Redskin, always wanted to be, you know, wanted to be a great fan and, and stand up for my team. And I mean, it's from, it's from me, you know, it's from where I am. So I went to Columbia, I'm a Columbia Lion, absolutely. You're an Ivy Leaguer. I am. And you were a math and physics major at Columbia. A absolutely. And from what I understand and what I, I wrote in my books, you didn't really want to play professional football. That wasn't really your goal. You wanted to be a physicist. I did, you know, I, I came, it's, it's true. I, I was, uh, I had a great high school career from New Rochelle, New York. And I, and I wasn't going to play football in high school because I just didn't like football. And the, the line coach sort of grabbed me one day and I was in the pool, swimming pool. And he said, Stark, upstairs, football practice. Ended up playing high school ball and also ended up being a high school American. Right? So now I'm an all-American football player that doesn't really like football that much. But I, I, my family didn't have a lot of money. So, you know, I was offered scholarships all over the country. Um, I just couldn't imagine playing three, four years of college. I just couldn't imagine. There you have it, some of the best moments from B&G Magazine. Before going, I'd like to thank all of my sponsors who have helped me with the show. They've been terrific, but I need more support. So I'd like to offer you the opportunity to further the growth of Burgundy and Gold Magazine. If you decide to do so, your company will gain valuable exposure throughout the Washington metropolitan area. Thanks so much, and I look forward to working with you. Victory. Praise.